what does it tell us that the kind of reporting that brought down a Joe McCarthy, that ultimately Nixon. brought down Nixon, along with the political, pro well, they also had the political process working, um, that ultimately got Americans to doubt the Vietnam War and even ultimately the Iraq War. When it came to Trump. I think it says a lot about the trust that exists um, in the media. Uh, I think it says a lot about our ability to interact with people who don't share our opinions. I think it says a lot about how this country has divided itself. I think it says a lot about the ways in which we um, inform ourselves. I mean, there's a, there's a number of things that go into it, and, and the rise of social media can't be discounted. The rise of being able to decide where you want to get your news. I like this opinion, so I'm going to go to this site. I want to hear these voices, so I've only followed these people on Twitter, or this is what my Facebook feed tells me. And then not looking at those things with a critical eye. I'm sure um, we're all guilty of that to a degree on both sides. You probably tailor your social feeds or or, or your outlets to, to places that you, that you agree with. But here's the thing about, about journalism. It should make you uncomfortable. I shouldn't be comforting you every day. I should be making you uncomfortable every day. Journalism is not, is not a, you know, a warm blanket. We are, we are shining a spotlight. Yeah. We are telling the truth, and the truth can be ugly. Most times the truth is ugly.